Hey, what's up, YouTube? Um, today we're gonna be installing this uh, wall mount by own O N N. It's for a 50 to 86 inch TV. Um, to doing that for um 75 inch high sense TV. Hey, what's up, YouTube? Uh, today we're gonna be doing the on. Uh, ONN TV wall mount, the 50 to 86 inch. Um, comes in a box like this. In the box, you got <clears throat> two brackets which go on to the back of the TV. You want your brackets to be the hook needs to go down because it's gonna hook onto this right here. So, this goes into the wall. So you got four studs that apply that to the wall. So you're going to do this job, you're going to need a stud finder. You know what I'm saying? I got a real good one right here from a Home Depot or Lowe's or something like that. <clears throat> Comes with a, also you might want to get a, a, either a screwdriver or an automatic drill or something like that. So you got four studs that go into the uh to the wall mount and then you got four screws that go into the brackets so they give you four different studs right here and then there's four different screws so you just find the ones uh that you want to use that are um, more suitable for your condition so whatever so you gotta look on the back of the tv and find out which ones look like they're gonna fit in the back of the tv and then for your wall studs you know if you got big studs um you can use a bigger screw Next thing you want to do is uh, put your brackets into the back and install them on the back of the TV. Um, now you want your your hook to be facing downwards, so it needs to go on the back of the TV like that, facing downwards. The hook does. First hole done. All right, first thing to do is to hand tighten it first. You don't want it too tight, so get you a screwdriver and tighten it up by hand at the end. Another thing you might want to consider uh, is putting on a washer before uh, you put your screws in. So I would take the weight and the size of the TV into consideration. Um, this is a 75 inch TV. So a TV of this, just the size, the size of it, it's not a very heavy TV, but just because it's a very large TV, I would recommend put on a washer. So it comes with four washers, four screws and four bolts. Also, um, you need to, the holes, uh, with the TV of this size, you're gonna have to go with the hole on the very the very highest hole probably um and if you want it your tv in a particular orientation or to be in an exact spot you might want to take some measurements before you uh actually start drilling holes into the wall so we're gonna go look at that now okay so we got our brackets in there and again like i said so this is the uh bottom of the tv and these should be facing downwards your bracket should be facing down okay and then they're just gonna hook right on top of the uh the wall mount so let's go uh take some measurements Okay, next thing you got to do, take some measurements, figure out where you want it, and then put your hanging template on the wall. You really need to use this because wherever your studs are, you want to find out which holes that you're going to drill into. So, I got a stud right here. I'm going to have to use this inside line on the bracket because this template is going to be the back bracket that goes on the wall. So, you're going to use these holes right here for your studs. So, they got these holes need to be on a stud. Money. These holes, you don't want your, the center of your stud on one of these pieces where the uh, metal bracket is going to be. 
Okay, the metal bracket's gonna be right there. You don't want a stud on that. So you want your stud to line up with one of these holes right here. So I'm gonna use the inside right here. So I got a good stud going right there. And I'm gonna use the inside of the second one right here on this side. And then go use the very, the most inner stud on this second, number two. And then the most inner bracket hole right here because I got studs on this one and this one and this one and this one. But I don't have a stud inside these right here. So you need to find out where your studs are and then get it close to center. Okay, so you want your wall mount, this bracket to be exactly on top of the template, wherever you marked it at. And then your brackets are gonna go right here and right here and right here and right here. All right, so we'll go ahead and put the TV on top of the brackets. So uh, I put the TV on the wall mount. Um, and then I didn't like, it was like the top of the TV. I guess I was off on my measurement, um, the first one. But it's just a little closer to the ceiling than I want it to be. Uh, so I want to bring it down a little bit. So easiest way to do that um, is just to uh, move this bracket up. So I set it to the, moved it to the highest setting instead of the lowest. And then after you put it on, uh, after you mount this onto the uh, bracket, all you're going to do is tighten up these screws on the bottom. Okay. Okay. And there you have it. There's a door right there. But uh you see how close it is to the ceiling though? I kinda wanna bring it down a little bit. But it's like I still got some room at the top. Anyways, you can take off your stuff right here. And this uh just tighten up your screws on the bottom. So you, if you want, um, using the highest bracket, you don't need a long screw screwdriver. Phillips long head, probably to reach it. If you're using the um, highest amount on the bracket, but if you're using the lowest bracket, the screws actually be like right here, almost lined up with the bottom of the uh, TV. Okay. And thanks for watching the video. <clears throat> Please like and subscribe to videos if you want to keep seeing more repair tips.